those who have no fast legs, those who without human health, there is no excuse for failure. Tell your neighbor, those who have no fast legs, those who without human help, there is no excuse for failure. Are you rejected? Are you abandoned? Come to Jesus. He is your companion, comforter. Are you without help? Come to Jesus. He is your helper. Tell your neighbor, there is no excuse for failure. There is no excuse for failure. For somebody to say, I cannot make it. And no. Jesus is there. As we all know, we are the father to the orphans. We are the husbands to the widows. We are the benefactors to the needy. And we are the companions to the lonely. Rededicate yourself to the act of giving in times of giving food, shelter, scholarship to the less privileged. This is what we are born for. Wave your hand and bow down your head and ask God to give you the grace to rededicate yourself. I want to rededicate myself. I want to rededicate myself to the act of giving in times of food, shelter. Scholarship to the less privileged in our community, in our environment. I want to be a father to the orphans, benefactor to the needy, companion to the lonely, husband to the widow. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. You may be seated. Listen, what is not done well is not done at all. Everything you have is actually only being borrowed from God. Tell your neighbor, everything I have is actually only being borrowed from God. Your hand, your hair, my hand, my shoulder, my knee. It is all from God in the first place. 
your money, your peace, your kindness, your goodness, your this, your that, is actually only being borrowed from God. The word amen means act of giving. When you give cheerfully, you say amen to your prayer. When you give cheerfully with humility, you say amen to your prayer. So when you do this, you are rejecting your destiny. It's an assignment from God. Assignment from God. From God. God. If you see it as an assignment from God, you cannot afford to fail God. There's no way. They cannot do it alone. If you live here now and go from one hospital to another, you see many people that just need 20,000 naira, 10,000 naira. And that 10,000 naira will be the one to save them from death. to leave you get home open your warehouse you'll see many things that people need to succeed with their life but they are lying there nothing doing nothing take it look for them help them your testimony should be this man change me this man contribute to my success your testimony is not how many houses you build how many cars you have how much you have in the bank account that is not testimony